nothing can stop me I'm all the way up What's going on YouTube? It's been a while since I put out a video for you guys. So before I went out and ran these errands, I just wanted to touch on a real quick topic. It's summertime. I know a lot of people are trying to lose weight, whether it's it's 20 pounds or the last five pounds before you can be comfortable taking the shirt off to go to the pool. Yeah, let's get into some weight loss. Okay guys, so there's no need really to make anything complicated. Uh, losing weight. The steps are simple. It's just a matter of whether or not you're doing the steps. You know what I mean? Pretty much everyone has a certain amount of calories that if they eat those calories every day, they're gonna maintain their body weight. And if you eat less than that, you lose weight. If you eat more than that, you gain weight. So how do you find this number? To keep it simple, go to Google and just type in maintenance calorie calculator. Click the first or second one you see. I'll ask you for your age, your height, your weight, how active you are, stuff like that. Fill it out to the best of your ability and it'll give you a roundabout number of your maintenance calories. You get your maintenance calories, you know, I said like, like I said earlier, you wanna eat less than that to lose weight. The important thing to remember is to take it nice and slow and make sure you're progressing over time in order to keep seeing results. So let's do a real quick example. I'll use myself because um, it's the easiest way to explain it. I know my maintenance calories since I've, I've done it before. So mine fall around about 2,800 calories a day for maintenance. So if I wanted to lose weight, which I, I don't at the moment, you want to take it nice and slow. So if it's 28, 2,800, I would drop to about 2,700. Or I may even do just to 2800 to start out with i would eat that for a week and then i would weigh myself i had lost two or more pounds by the end of that week that first week or two i'd keep my calories the same and keep eating that if i had lost less than a pound i would drop them another another hundred you want to stay in between one to two pounds of weight loss per week it keeps it safe it keeps you motivated, so that's a good number to fall in between. Um, the important thing is to remember to start somewhere and just make small adjustments as you go. You don't want to, if it's 2,800, you don't want to drop down to 2,000 because you might lose five or six pounds to start with, but after that, where are you going to go? Obviously, you can't keep going down to 1,000 calories and 500 calories because that's not healthy and you're just going to be mad at yourself always think too you know is you have to eat chicken breast and vegetables and salads and, and stuff like that to lose weight which is not necessarily the case you can if you ate all your calories in ice cream you might not feel that great <laughs> but um you would still lose the weight now i don't recommend that you know i, I throw ice cream in my calories you know every now and then myself happy but it's more so about the calories when it comes to weight loss it's your calorie goals and make sure you stay in between one to two pounds a week if it's under that you drop it another hundred or so uh, if it's above two pounds two or more pounds keep it the same you're doing good if you just eat healthy and cut down what you're eating and start going to the gym you're definitely gonna lose some weight if you haven't been doing that but if you want to see consistent consistent results and you want to drop that weight continuously and know that you're going to make progress from week to week then it's really important to track what you're eating and make sure you're hitting that calorie target as close as you can every day use uh my fitness pal me my girlfriend my buddy maurice we all use that to track how much we're eating to make sure we're hitting that target usually just eat um track it real quick takes a minute or two no big deal but if you really want the results i would use my fitness pal or some form of uh, uh food log to track what i'm eating that's about it for weight loss guys um, simplest way to put it that to at least get you started if you have any additional questions or you want any more information um you can visit my website i'll put a link but link to my website below in the description other than that 
Uh, go start your diet, hit the gym, do some cardio. Go ahead and lose that last five or 10 pounds. It's not stopping you, except yourself. Nothing can stop me, I'm all the way up. Hey!